What is going on YouTube? It's your boy, Matty J, aka SK All Day. What's happening out there, people? This is Best Class Setups number episode three. And this uh, episode, I will be going over the AK-12, which is basically like the AK-47 um, from back in the day. Uh, the AK-12 is actually a very decent weapon. As you guys can see, it is an assault rifle in the assault rifle class. You guys can see the stats there at the bottom right hand of uh, the screen. Accuracy is decent. The damage is very high. Uh, there's only there's the three most powerful weapons. is the AK-12, MSBS, and also the Remington. The Remington I will be going over in a later video. The range is actually also pretty decent as well. Fire rate is medium. I mean, the AK is really never going to have like a really high fire rate, but it still works. It's still a decent gun, in my personal opinion. Um, it's probably the second best assault rifle. Uh, Remington is a little bit more accurate, but this one is definitely more uh, more powerful, uh, in my opinion. Uh, let's go over my uh, class setup. Uh, my attachments are extended mags, which allows you to have uh, more ammo in each magazine. Uh, the suppressor or silencer attachment and also the foregrip. Uh, as you guys know, pretty much all AKs have a lot of recoil. The recoil isn't overly bad in this game, but the foregrip does help. So I like using it. I like having the as you know least amount of recoil as possible, and uh, it definitely works for me. Secondary, no, uh, have no secondary, no lethal, no tactical. I want to maximize my perks to my uh, to the best of my advantage. Let's go ahead and get into the perks setup really quick. Uh, my first perk is takedown. Takedown, uh, as you guys know, um, kill enemies without revealing their death locations. My next perk is going to be dead silence, which allows you to move silently across the map. Amplify is going to be my next uh, my next perk. Uh, it's like sit rare pro for Modern Warfare 3. It allows you to uh, to increase enemies' footsteps and also allows you to hear dead silence players, which is very effective, especially if you're going to be uh, infiltrating the enemy spawns and, and doing a lot of rushing. Uh, next is going to be three attachments, which is why you guys see that I have three attachments uh, on my AK-12. Um, it, it can be beneficial. Um, extended mags you don't necessarily need really a whole lot, but I just use it because I feel that it works best for me in the way that my playstyle is and the way that uh, and the game modes that I particularly play. And then off the grid, which is like assassin, allows you to be undetectable for satcoms and also radar pings. So let's go ahead and jump into the specialist package that I have selected. Uh, my specialist package is scavenger. Scavenger, after I get three kills, I will attain that perk, which is, allows you to resupply ammo from dead players. Focus is going to be my six kill, uh, my six kill specialist perk, which is uh, allows you to. It's, it's, it's basically for the flinch. I'm not really worried about the weapon sway in this game, but uh, it, it allows you to reduce the flinch when you're being shot at. So that helps, especially on a gun that's not necessarily the most accurate. And then I have Stalker, and that's going to be my third uh, my third perk in my specialist. And then my specialist bonus after I get 12 kills is going to be Slay to Hand. It's going to be Agility, which is actually increased movement. It's kind of like lightweight from back in the day. And then I have Tack Resist, which allows you to be resist, uh, shows resistance to flash stun and EMP effects. They're very, very powerful in this game. If you get stunned or flash, you can pretty much call it quits. <laughs> the enemy will come and kill you because you will not be able to recover for that. It takes about like at least a good five seconds to recover from a stun or a flash in this game. And then also Blast Shield. When you kill enough enemies in, in a particular area, they're going to start throwing out random grenades. They're going to start throwing out C4, uh, you know, things like that. So you want to protect yourself and you want to have uh, Blast Shield equipped, which, you know, just gives you that increased resistance to explosive damage. But... Hope you guys enjoy this class setup video. Hope you guys do get a chance to try out this particular class setup. If you guys want to tweak it around to, to whatever fits your play style, that completely works as well. This is more geared towards the rushing specialist uh, class setup for the assault rifles. So hope you guys enjoyed the informative video. If you guys did, go ahead and leave a like rating. It's always greatly appreciated. If you guys have any particular suggestions or a particular gun that you would like to see in the series, go ahead and let me know in the comment section, and I'll be sure to get to all those guns and requests as soon as possible. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. It's your boy SK. I'm out of y'all. Be easy, man. Peace.